Hey guys, it's Bams and Bam, and this is tip of the day number three. Uh, okay, so I'll be showing you the weird shot today, and this is just an example of it. Basically, it makes your sniper go weird. Um, it's pretty simple to do. You basically need to use overkill, and then you have either a grenade launcher, shotgun, or um, or you can also use a hybrid sight. The easiest one is with a grenade launcher, which is fine, but what you have to do is press left on the D-pad and triangle at the same time while you're using your assault rifle. Basically, that's pulling out the grenade launcher and canceling at the same time. And what this does is makes the sniper do this. And when you know you get it right, it will switch to the sniper and then do a half switch and come back to the sniper and it'll look in a weird position. So I'm just showing you with the other ones, uh, some of these other snipers, and definitely the Barrett looks the weirdest out of um, all the snipers that you do. It goes up really high like this, yeah. And um, it takes a bit of practice. If you don't get the first time, switch back to your assault rifle and take the grenade launcher off, then try it again, just press it left on the d-pad and try and get it. Um, for xbox that would be um, y i'm pretty sure which is the top one the top button and um, left on, the on your d-pad as well and basically just getting a grenade launcher and switching weapon at the same time so you can do it with all these other equipment and basically it changes it so you can do an acog scope or when you have a flash um, you can throw it or a concussion grenade and your gun will go down the bottom and this is after you've actually done the um, um, done the weird shot, so it's in that position, and the frag. Um, it makes it actually, you can see yourself shooting. And also the same text, you can see yourself throwing it, and it goes down low at the same time. And the smoke just puts it down low, like the fl flash grenade, is like all these ones do, and you can see throwing the smoke. The tactical insertion just puts it down low, so um, if you, ha you can cancel the tactical insertion, you have to put it down. So if you want it just down low, and also the portable radar. So if you have one of these and you just want to you know, try out the shot, it's really cool. It's good. And also the claymore, this is, I don't know, this is really strange, but yeah, it basically just puts it up in, right in front of you and you can't see anything. Um, well, you can't see stuff, but yeah. And all of these you can scope, it just, you have to, you don't see the quick scope in motion. The scrambler also makes it very similar to the claymore. It's, um, I think it's just, it looks a bit different because I used a different gun, but yeah, it's exactly the same. When you use C4, you don't have to throw it, you actually just hold um, the C4 to throw it and cancel it, and then you get your hand up here, and you can still use the C4 on the mic when doing it, which looks really cool. With the throwing knife, you just hold the throwing knife and then cancel, and you'll get, your gun will go invisible, and you can shoot normally. You can also scope fully as well, and it won't show in the kill cam either, so you have no gun. And then you can also, once you've done the weird shot, you go up to a bomb and you plant. You don't have to plant the whole way, but then you see this is the best effect I reckon of all of them. And you see this, how you plant the bomb still on your gun. It's crazy, you can scope normal. And all of these you can climb up ladders, sprint, whatever you do. All you have to do is cancel, just press triangle. And here's just a few camp, kill cams to show you that you know, it actually does work, and that's an APOG one. Um, here's with the Barrett, and it's just using one of the equipments to go down the bottom. Um, probably a tactical insertion, I'd say. And then here I have a Semtex, so you can see when I shoot, the Semtex brings it down, the gun comes down from top, and that's a really cool effect to finish it up. And just showing with the C4, you can still use the C4, it just adds a really nice effect. So, yeah, thanks guys for watching. Um, if you see this on Arch Douchebag or um, Combustion Theatre, don't forget to come and check me out. So thanks for watching.